Well, I think she lost them this afternoon. And right now, I'm not even aware that she knows they're missing. What the hell are you doing here? What do you want? You can relax if that's at all possible. I'm just here doing Mrs. Whitney another favor. Just give her these. She'll understand. Well, the point is, I don't understand. Now, how did you get those? Well, they must have fallen out of her purse when she was checking the contents after it was stolen this afternoon. Yeah? You're the one that snatched it. On the contrary, I'm the one who retrieved it. Oh, really? Well, isn't that exciting? I haven't seen a hero all day. Well, then the pleasure should be yours. Oh, so what do you want, a reward now? No, no. My honesty in seeing you again today is reward enough. Very complex man. He's love. Is it all right if I leave now before Mr. and Mrs. Whitney get home? It's getting late. Oh, what do you want to leave now for? We've got the house all to ourselves. My mother's expecting me. Oh. Well, all right. Go ahead, kid. Take off. Oh, wait. Uh, uh, give my regards to your mother. For heaven's <laughs> sakes, why should I do that? She doesn't even know you. Well, she just might someday. Yeah, she just might. <laughs> Quickly, my friend, I'm grateful. You have them? Here. They match perfectly. Your contribution is much appreciated. What I need, if you've got it, is an electric device. Don't, don't, don't tell me anything more. Please. I don't want to know. Please, just give me my money. That's right, and I would like to pay cash. Oh, all righty. You have waited here so long for me to finish. It's very kind of you. Oh, not at all. It's the least I can do. That comes to 4500 Oh, okay. Um, there is a little more than that here, but I would like for you to have it. You've done me so many favors. Oh. Besides, I almost lost it all today, and I might as well spend it all. What do you mean? I had the most horrible experience outside your shop. What happened? But well, this little rat came up and he grabbed my purse and he went running off and then this guy standing next to me ran after him and he got the purse back, but uh, the thief had disappeared. Oh, how perfectly awful. There's so much of that these days, which is not safe anyway. I'm so sorry. Well, anyway, I got everything back, so it's all right. Good. My husband is going on a business trip tonight, so uh, since he gave me all this money to spend, I guess I'd better go kiss him goodnight. Bye-bye. Uh, Bye-bye. Nice. Finished packing, Gunther. We've got to be leaving in about an hour. Yes, sir. I'm all set to go for you. Oh, uh, by the way, Miss Whitney, uh, you might be interested in these. 
some guy dropped by here this afternoon and left Mrs. Whitney's keys. Can I get you a dancer? The best. The very best. Mrs. Whitney's purse this afternoon. He happened to be near there, so he ran the thief down and got the purse back. He said that uh, she probably dropped the keys when she was checking the contents. But did she get hurt? No, I don't think so. Anybody call the police? Well, the guy didn't say. Uh, it must have happened uh, just before I saw them in this neighborhood place, uh, having a drink together. What place? Well, it's a bar that I go to sometimes for a beer and a game of darts. Well, that's quite a coincidence. Yeah. Yeah, well, the guy must have been telling the truth, Mr. Whitney, because I questioned him after Mrs. Whitney left. And uh, he said that she insisted on paying for the drinks as her way of saying thanks. Said he didn't want a reward. Hmm. A generous man. Hmm. Yeah. Well, I guess there was no harm done. Yeah, well, why don't you bring these bags downstairs to the car, Gunther? I'll ask Mrs. Whitney about it when she comes home. Yes, sir. I guess you're right, though. No, uh, no harm was done.